What's up, Flips? Total Master, and welcome to this different video today. I will be predicting the Euro 2021 or 2020, depends how you want to call it, um, tournament or matches and everything. Because, yeah, I like to do that, those things. It's always fun to do it, so. Yep, let's get into it. So, we start off with Group A. We have Switzerland, Turkey, Wales, and Italy. Now, I think Italy should be the first. I think Switzerland would actually bomb out in fourth, and then it's kind of hard. Do I go for Wales or Turkey as being second? I think Wales will be second. And Turks third, I guess. Yeah, okay. Group B, I think the winner of that group is relatively easy. Belgium. And kind of hard to say. Um, I think I'll go Denmark second, Russia third, and Finland fourth. Yeah, I think that's how I'll do it. Group C, I think Netherlands should have this one in the bag. That's kind of hard to go for second. Do I go Ukraine or Austria? I think I'll go Ukraine with Austria third, and Macedonia fourth. Or nope, Macedonia, so the Greeks don't get offended. <laughs> I'm just joking. Anyways, um. Group D. I think England should have this one in the back to have revenge on Croatia, who will come in second. And then I believe Scotland should be third with the Czech Republic fourth. <clears throat> in Group E, I think the winner will be Spain. And then it's kind of hard. Does Lewandowski bring Poland to second? I think yes, he does. With Sweden third and Slovakia fourth. Now this is where it gets spicy, right? I gotta make a prediction. I'll start with Germany, and I'll put them in third. I feel Germany will be third. I feel like they don't have enough firepower to be any higher. Hungary third, France will win the group with Portugal second. Now I have to pick fourth, uh, be four best third placed teams. I think Germany will get in, I think Sweden should get in, I think Turkey should get in, and I will say Russia. Okay, let's continue. <clears throat> so Belgium, Sweden, I think Belgium should have this one in the bag. Italy, Ukraine, I think Italy. France, Turkey, I think France. Croatia, Poland, Croatia. Then we have Spain versus Russia. I think I'll go with Spain. Okay, this is the first tough one. England, Portugal. I feel like this one is could be a very important match because I feel like there are two really good teams. I think England will go through, but just slightly. But Netherlands and Germany is another difficult one. But I think Germany will drop, will bomb out in the round of sixteen. I, I just don't feel, I don't trust Germany this year. I don't know why. Wales, Denmark. I feel like Wales will go through. Okay, so we have Belgium, Italy, France, Croatia, Spain, England, and Netherlands, Wales in the quarters. And I will progress Belgium to the semi-finals alongside with France. We have a repeat of the 2018 World Cup final, but I think France will go through. Spain, England, and a difficult one. I will go with England, though. Um, Netherlands, Wales. I believe Netherlands should be able to get through. I think that. Okay, so semi-finals: Belgium, France. I believe France should be going through to the final. I think Belgium's a really solid team, but France is extremely good. England and Netherlands. Let's put England to the final, and then we have the grand final of France versus England. Like that would be such an epic final because, like. I don't know, it's just because of the history of the nations, like, not just football-wise, but pretty much, you know, everywhere. It just feels like, I don't know, it could be, like, really cool. It would be just a really cool final, no? Um, I think France would win it, though. I think France are just too good. Uh, I think that they are pretty much the best team. 
they are extremely good. I don't think anyone can beat them. That's how I feel. Um, yeah, I mean, I did make probably make some interesting choices. For example, making Germany bomb out so fast and making England go all to the final. But I think I think either of England and Portugal will go to the if like if this is the path their path. I feel England and Portugal are the strongest in this half of the 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 the, the, the group of the bracket. And their the meeting so early on would be you know it's a bit of a shame I suppose you could say but um I believe England or Portugal would go to the final in this case I just picked England because I don't know I feel like they they have a really strong team um, Portugal have a strong team of course as well but I feel like England could be just a bit better um. Any other interesting choices? I don't think. I mean, this side of the bracket, I, I think I did pretty normally. This side, as I said, maybe Germany going out so fast and um, England going out to the final would be a bit surprising to some, perhaps. But yeah, this is how I feel. It will go. It could go. I don't know. We'll see. I'll maybe um, drop in after the, the, the tournament and see how well I did. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching and till next time, fuck off.